extraction. Okay? Remember, your fats are, ang sagay sila, are they polar or non-polar? And your peanuts. Okay? The next thing you need to do is to add now your solvent. Okay? Okay, solvent extraction man. So for today, we will be using your ether. Ether is a non-polar solvent. So basically, the ether will dissolve the fats that are in the food samples, no? So ala na siya, no? So iyan na siyang i-extract ang mga fats na naadili. So for this experiment, we will be using 25 ml of ether, okay? So we measure it using a graduated cylinder, all right? Sige of kanang ether, di ba, using a graduated cylinder, you read the meniscus at the eye level. You don't, ano, ano, di ka mag-ihala ba, no? Ito, this way din is siya. You should read it through the eye level. So that would give you a 25 ml. So, ang inyong buhaton, instead of directly Placing the ether in the flask, it would be better that you first wash your mortar and pestle. Kato yung gidukdukan gani ha? You wash it first with the solvent. The reason for that is in order for you to make sure that all of the crumbs are also included in the flask. No? So let's try washing the mortar and pestle with our ether first. No? And then, wash, 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 and then, transfer. Okay? Transfer. Okay? So, you just wash it like this. So, that would ensure that all of your crumbs are transferred. Afterwards, what do you need to do? You need to swirl this for five minutes. Swirling allows for the extraction of fats, okay? So, Manglala will help me swirl this for me. And I will do the same for my peanuts, okay? So, for my peanuts, again. I will measure again 25 ml of my ether. So, kanin ether class, kay baho kayo ni siya. In fact, it's anesthetic. Mo na ka, we're wearing PPE kay. It's very dangerous. And then transfer. Right? And then place. After that, swirl for five minutes. Okay? Gently, but constantly. So we'll do this for five minutes now. This is the longest process class. So while I was swirling, so may nahita po dere, no? So while while I am swirling this, what happens here is your ano? Your fats now are being extracted by the solvent. Okay? They're now being extracted by the solvent, by the ether. Okay? So this ensures total extraction. So the swirling actually enhances extraction process. Okay? So swirl, swirl, swirl for five minutes. Question. Nakoy question class. Well, nag swirl ko dili. When I say extraction of fats, do I only mean fats alone? Or does it include oils as well? What do you think? When I say extraction of fats, fats na ba ko ma-extract or ma-extract na ko apil ang mga oils? Okay. Including the oils. Kaya again, like what I've mentioned, fats in nutrition collectively means dietary triacyl glycerol. Okay? So five minutes is almost done. Okay? Swirl, swirl lang din ka. Patience is a virtue. Kaya dapat ma-extract na natin ang dapat din ka. So 
So make sure guys, mga kumo swirl ko dili ani no, dili kay nang murag open bitaw kay itabon ni siyang palm kay ano man, volatile kasi eater, bulupad na siya. Oh, wala mo eater ko man ana. Okay, so five minutes is already over, ladies and gentlemen. So what do we need the, the, to do next? Okay, so now, Okay? So, the next thing we need to do is we need to filter the ether. Okay, ano man? Ang katong ether, naaman nga to ang fat. So, ika-filter na mo, we collect the filtrate. Because the filtrate contains now the fat. But before filtering it, they collect na itong filtrate to. So we will collect it through these beakers. We will collect our filtrate through these beakers. But how do we, before we actually fil collect the filtrate, a way sa tanyang empty beaker, okay? I will explain later what is the significance of weighing an empty beaker, okay? So again, so by the way, we label the beakers as well. Okay, lahi lahi ba ito atong po ano atong sample? So, for example, kani bitaw nga areas sa beaker class or test tubes kana ngay mo nagputi blue de or puti. Pwede na sa lato sa watan ng label. Mo na yung purpose, okay? So, mabutang tadi ha o PC means potato chips, okay? P means peanuts, okay? So, ato na siyang timbangon una ang empty beaker. Sige. I-record ya, ha? Sige. Empty beaker for potato chips. Ha? Empty beaker for potato chips. Ilaman ang way niya. Empty beaker for potato chips. That's 49.4 Okay? Empty beaker for potato chips That's 49.4 Record sa table Kana ka sa yung worksheet Okay? How about for the Peanut? Empty beaker for the peanut That's actually Sorry, na turn up na po Okay? For the peanuts, that's actually for a while. That's forty-nine point nine. Okay. For the empty beaker for the peanuts, that's forty-nine point nine. So you get it? Nakawala niyo mama sa empty beaker class. Empty beaker for potato chips, that's 49.4. And then peanuts, that's 49.9. Okay? After that, we're gonna filter it out. Okay? So, how do we filter it? We use your filter paper. Okay? So, fold the filter paper properly. And then after that, Okay, fold it properly. After that, place that in your funnel. Okay? Sige. So, ari na rin siya. I-collect din mo ang filter, ang filtrate, nga po sa emong gi, giway na daan na deeper. Sige. Okay? So, para i-yabon ni mo, swirl, 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 and then yabon. Okay, you collect the filtrate because this is the most important, the filtrate. Okay, so kani nakita niyo class no, ang medyo murky pa siya, na po siya mga nahabilit. So para ka, ma make sure din mo nga ma-appeal na siya o quantify, you wash it with few ml of ether. Okay, you wash na din mo siya ether. For that, wash lang. Wash lang ganyan mo siya ether, okay? Para ma-appeal ka rin mo ang mga napilit and then appeal. Okay? Okay. Do the same thing for your peanuts. Okay? So, 
for your peanuts again. You filter it through a filter paper. After that, place that in a funnel and then swirl the flask. Swirl, 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 and pour over. Okay? Again, wash the container with few ml of your ether. potato chips, okay? So, in this filtrate, na ni siya ether, nasa ni siya sa atong extracted fat. So, what you need to do now is, you need to filter and uh, remove the ether. How do we remove the ether? Remember, your fats are non-volatile, correct? Your ether is very volatile. Therefore, we can remove this by evaporation. Okay? So how do we do that evaporation? We use now your hot plate. Okay? So hot plate is like a stove. But in the context of the laboratory, it's actually known as a hot plate. Okay? So ato na siyang painitun dira. We don't heat it class using a Bunsen burner. Because the Bunsen burner is very, very, it's actually very, very strong. Or perhaps it will actually catch fire. So, ibo na na ibutang diha ang imong beaker ng ether. And then, it will start to boil. Okay, so ako ipadukol ninyo sa camera at para makita mga bubutal na siya. Okay? You would notice that it will start boiling. So, once it boils, it will remove all of the ether. Here is now our extracted fats coming from our potato chips. Tawa. This much. Imagine, no? So this is now the amount of potato chips. I mean, the amount of fats that we were able to extract from our potato chips. Remember, how much potato chips did we use? How much potato chips did we use? Okay, five kapin. Diba? Dinan na kadaghan ang mantika na ato gikuan. Remember ha? Five grams of potato chips is just mga six pieces of piatos. Imagine. Dinan na kadaghan. Okay? Let's wait for your peanuts. So this is now for your Peanuts. Tawa. No? So, tawa ang peanuts class. This is the amount of fats present in one pack of happy. No? So, you see, there's actually a lot. So, atong buhaton, we first pull it down. Okay? So again, ha? these are your fats, okay? This one is for your potato chips. And this one is from your peanuts. You see it now? Huh? Kaon ng piatos, inalik ka daghang mantika yung kanon. Do you follow? Five grams na lang, ha? How much more pila ka naka grams yung mahurot, no? Nagpahit usap ka, basi makahot mo usap ka katong dako kaayo. No? Sao na lang. Okay? 
So, ang atong sunod mo atong, we're gonna weigh this beaker. Okay? Atong na yung weigh na beaker class. Alright? Okay. So, we're gonna weigh our beakers now. Okay? So, record there in your table. Kailangan ko an. Beaker plus pa. Beaker plus pa. So for potato chips, beaker plus fat, that's actually 12. And all of our balance, okay? So beaker plus fat, that's 50.4 No? Okay, always remember ha? Kano? So, beaker plus fat for potato chips That's 50.4 grams Okay? So, how about for the peanuts? Beaker plus fat That's actually 50.4 51 51.0 grams Okay? So, for the peanuts That's 51.0 gram Okay? So, later I will show you How do we calculate the amount of fats No? Using the data that we obtained Okay? Sige So, kasabot rata class No? So, any questions about the experiment? Okay? So, these are your results. This much fat is actually present in a 5-gram food. Okay? Sige. Questions? Questions? Hello? Huh? Shani? Any questions? None, sir. How about the others? None, sir. Okay. If none, then I'm giving you five another five minutes break. So let's be back at 3.40. And then I will teach you how do we calculate the amount of fats present here. Okay? So see you in five minutes. Let's meet at 3.40. Okay? So ayan guys, natapos na namin yung ano, live na love demonstration sa Fats and Oils Biochem na subject ng um, Opto, Opto yung students. So guys, thank you for watching. Sana nag-enjoy po kayo sa vlog ko today. At huwag niyo pong kalimutan mag-like, comment, and subscribe sa akin channel. At hit niyo po yung notification bell button para ma-update po kayo sa mga bago kong upload. See you next time. Bye!